Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna show you how to deadlift properly. If you are not deadlifting and it's not part of your regular routine in your program, whether you're an athlete or if you're just trying to get in shape and change the composition for your body, this might be, next to back squats, the single most important and effective exercise that you can do in order to change your body. We're gonna start with the setup. So the first part is setting up for a deadlift properly. And again, this is a conventional deadlift. We need to get your stance right and your grip right, your hand position. So this is how I want you to do it. So the first thing we wanna do is step up to the bar and stand directly in the center. The first thing we have to do is set your arm position. Where you grab onto the bar or where your arms naturally hang. So if you look at me in the video, I'm not wide and I'm not super narrow. My arms are just naturally hanging loosely. Wherever they hang loosely, I'll grab evenly on both sides of the bar. That's the correct position for your hand. After that, we're gonna set the legs in the proper position. So we're not wide, this isn't a sumo deadlift, it's conventional deadlift. So after the arm position is established, the legs go just inside of where your arms naturally hang. Another important note, the bar needs to be basically touching your shins from front to back. You do not want this bar way far in front of you. After that, you're gonna rotate your elbows inward while you're holding the bar. This engages and locks down the lats so that you're creating tension throughout your entire body. So a correct foot position, hand position, notice how I lock my lats in place and my spine is completely straight. From here, the chest comes up, we're gonna move through the hips, power forward, lock the glutes out, and squeeze the entire body. Then we're gonna gently bend the knees, push the hips back, the bar lowers to the original position, back next to the shins. Lock the lats into place, rotate the elbows inward towards your body again, and then we power through the hips. That's how we want to deadlift. Nice and easy. So once we have full body tension and that's established, that's what we wanna do. A big fault, if you notice in this part, do not round your back and pick up the bar. You will screw your back up. You'll have tons of lower back pain. If you are ever feeling pain in your lower back as a result of deadlifting, there's one of two things happening. You're either rounding your spine, as in this segment, or what you're doing is you are picking up your hips first, as I'm showing in this segment. So we do not want to lift our butt up and then our chest as in that portion right there. We do not want to do that. We want the chest to come up first. So correct position, good starting position, spine is straight, chest comes up before the hips. So the most important thing to take away from that, focus on the setup first. If your setup is crappy, your lift is going to be crappy. So take it step by step and set your arms and your feet in the right position and then set your spine in the right position and create tension in your whole body. After you have a good starting position and you're tight, then you can explode with control and activate all the proper muscles. If you have back pain, refer back to the video about the faults because you're either lifting your hips first before you're lifting your chest or you're rounding your back. So focus on those things. Let me know if you have any questions, comments, leave it below and I'll be happy to answer. I hope that was helpful and I'll see you in the next video.